Hi everyone, I'm David Lee, a game dev program manager at Visual Studio. I'm excited to share with you some of the hard work from our team that will benefit all game developers. Today, I will walk you through some top improvements that enable Double Fine Productions to overcome productivity challenges while making Psychonauts 2. I will also showcase some new improvements that they are looking forward to in VS 2022. Let's get started. Throughout the development of the game, Double Fine loved using Visual Studio 2019. One of the biggest productivity boosts came when building the game. At Double Fine, the developers were not happy with their build iteration speed despite using distributed build systems to decrease their build times. When Visual Studio introduced link time improvements in VS 2019 16.8, the developers at Double Fine were able to greatly reduce time spent on build iteration. Similarly, Visual Studio introduced performance improvements for debug builds in 16.10, which also reduced time spent debugging. One engineer told me that debugging was a joy in VS 2019 as it eliminated the crashes they've seen in VS 2017. Right now, Double Fine is gearing up for Visual Studio 2022. The studio is excited to explore the trove of productivity improvements we have in store. They can't wait to try out the speedy new 64-bit IDE. Chad Dawson from Double Fine said, As tech director, I switch between many of our game projects throughout the day to compile and review the latest code. The improved project load times and faster link times in Visual Studio 2022 are exciting and will be a welcome improvement to my workflow. For others, they will experience notable speed improvements in actions such as finding files, find out references, opening a C++ file, and IntelliSense ready, shaving seconds off each time they use the features throughout the day. For Unreal Engine developers like Double Fine, an 18x improvement in IntelliSense ready times for UE projects is ready and waiting in VS 2022. And that's not all. One of the features that Double Fine has been waiting for to try out is IntelliCo for Unreal Engine. Let me show you. Here, I'm using the Action RPG demo on Unreal Engine 4 with the Winter is Coming theme in Visual Studio. We are here in the function that deals with damage attributes. Imagine you're coding along and want to list the members in the pawn class. Normally, when accessing members of a class, IntelliSense may give you a long list of functions or variables to choose from. What's new here are four context-aware suggestions denoted by the star. Now, for any C++ developer, there is a model predicting common practices. For Unreal Engine, we train the AI model using many Unreal code bases. IntelliCode will give special casing for Unreal Engine types. Here, you see Get Controller, Get Movement Component, and others denoted by the star. For a studio like Double Fine with many teams, this is great. Any studio can set up their own IntelliCode model. By training the model over your own code base locally, IntelliCode can provide suggestions based on your team's coding habits and frequently used internal types. Here, in a different case, when you type the arrow operator, you can see two different star noted suggestions. This is IntelliCode knowing the context in which a member might be used frequently. Let's say you're a new hire. You can quickly get up to speed with your team's coding patterns. Or if you're a developer learning a new game engine or language, you can see how other developers use frequently used member functions and decrease your learning time. Of course, if you are an experienced developer, these sort of suggestions will save you time as you won't have to scroll through this long list of functions, vars, and enums. IntelliCode is only one of many Visual Studio features that saves you precious time during game development. You can give IntelliCode a try by enabling it in the game development with C++ or .NET desktop development workload in the VS installer. 
Aside from all the performance improvements we made in VS 2022, we have great new features such as live share for remote collaboration and Git integrations. We'll be continuously making improvements thanks to feedback from you. Thinking about upgrading, we want to make upgrading as easy as possible. Want to use an old compiler? No problem. Don't want to upgrade your tool sets? You won't have to. Looking to use open source third-party libraries? Get them with VC Package. Download and try VS 2022 today and tell us what you think in our survey. Thank you so much.